political leaders and uh, the, the managers of the hospitals are very important in this mm. issue. Uh, speaking about running a hospital, what would be more efficient uh, to have a head with a strong medical background or rather one with an MBA diploma? Well, ideally, I think you should have both. Um, I have uh, medical training and I have an MBA. Um, and I think um, you should have very senior doctors with some management training at the top of a hospital because two reasons one they can understand where healthcare is going also if the doctor another doctor comes and says i need this i need that they can say no no you don't so i think that's important but no doctor will pay the kind of attention that a good manager will pay. So you need both. So I think you need, at the top of the hospital, some doctors with some management training. But to support them and to run the hospital on a day-to-day -day basis, you need good administrators and managers as well. Domnișoara Butolo, în condițiile din România, unde, după cum bine știți, șefii spitalelor au două, trei, chiar patru locuri de muncă. Sunt profesor la universitate, director de clinică privată, șef de secție în spital de stat. Considerați viabil un astfel de model? Cred că depinde de la om la om. Am, am cunoscut persoane în sistemul nostru medical care își fac treaba foarte bine și ca șef de secție, și ca profesor, și ca uh, medic într-o clinică privată. Uh, ca un prim model din anii facultății a fost domnul doctor Raed Arafat, care uh, l-am cunoscut uh, ca medic la Smurt, în Târgu Mureș, și din câte se vede și evoluția dânsului pe plan administrativ în uh, sistemul medical, uh, este de lăudat. Și care nu este român. Și care, este, nu este, și care nu este român. Uh, Dr. Mann, uh, how important is in the whole framework the nurse activity, uh, which is considered rather a low-profile job in Romania? Yes, I, I think nursing is very important because two reasons. One, most of the time a patient sees anybody in a hospital, it is nurses, it's not doctors. The doctors come, they treat and they go away. So it's important that the nurses know how to do that well. The second reason is that I think in a very efficient hospital you should be able to delegate more things to nurses. So for instance in America if you go to the best hospitals the anesthesia the sleep putting to sleep in the, is done by nurses under the supervision of a doctor whereas in England it's all done by doctors and actually The nurses are better because they pay more attention. The doctors get bored. And, and so I think doctors have to learn to give nurses more authority and responsibility and not be frightened because that gives doctors a more complex work to do. So, and that needs you to train nurses better. And it probably means you need to recruit more educated nurses than, than in the past. Romanian doctors, and the Romanian health system, is overloaded with uh, bureaucratics, with papers. Um, I don't know, maybe uh, Miss Butolo can tell you about how many papers a doctor need to complete for a patient. One problem, it's not uh, that we have to complete, we have to uh, write by hand everything. Mm. So this is uh, a very, very important problem in my opinion. Also, all the blood tests, all the paraclinical investigation, we are waiting uh, for them on papers. Maybe we need also an uh, informatic system to uh, send all the investigation just uh, in, a, in, the on, same in the same system. Yeah. Uh, the, the managers in the health system in Romania, the political leaders and the managers uh, of the health ministry are a little bit freak controls. So, uh, everything is over-regulated. But on the other hand, uh, this is, uh, it, it's, it's getting uh, the job very, very hard to be done by the, the, the medical doctors yeah. and by the nurse, of course. Yeah. Two things. First of all, I think that um, just improving your IT, informatics, 
doesn't solve the problem because a good informatics, first you have to have good basic paper systems. Uh, if you just take a rubbish paper system and put it into informatics, you get a rubbish informatics. So that is important. So first you must get rid of all the rubbish questions. Uh, we also in England have a terrible bureaucracy. And that is because if it is all owned by the government, you have to fill in all the papers to show that the government money is being spent properly. properly. And I think that's again why you must let go of a little control, because in the end the doctor can't spend half his time doing paperwork and only half treating patients. And you see that, and it, but it's very difficult again, it's a bit like the black money, it's a habit. And if a government is serious, it says, why do we have all this information? So much is duplicated, let's get rid of it. So when somebody says, what is the such and such? You say, well, we don't collect that. It's not necessary. And that takes a courage by the government to do that.